At least 50 people have been killed and several injured in Chad after security forces violently cracked down on anti-government protests. Another protest took place in several cities, including Chad's capital, N'Djamena. And this was on Thursday local time. Now the government says several security personnel are included in the death toll and claim that security forces were acting in self-defense. Protesters had barricaded roads and set fire to the Prime Minister's party headquarters, calling for a swifter transition to democracy. Last month, President Mohamed Idris Deby pushed back the democratic elections until October 2024. The protests came the day after he was originally supposed to step down.